All right, I'm making this quick video here just to show you guys how to source a 4 to 20 signal, either back to the PLC or for troubleshooting purposes. Here we have a 773, and I will be sourcing signal back to this 179, our true RMS multimeter. So first thing we want to do, go to milliamps, switch it over to DC. Make sure your terminals, your connections are all good. Um, and then we got set up for simu simulate and also check it out for the power. And we're gonna be sending a 4 to 20 back to this guy. So what you wanna do is get that clamp on there, positive side. Only got one hand, sorry, can't do this with two. Put that guy there. Uh, so we want to turn this guy on. Notice it's on a clamp. You can also measure a 4 to 20 with this guy without breaking the loop. Uh, just clamp it on the wire and measure your 4 to 20. So right now we're ready to. So we're going to go to source. And we want to send a signal back to the PLC, so zero, which is zero percent, four milliamps. So we're measuring four milliamps in the loop right now. So four zero four milliamps, zero percent. So if you have a tank, you're simulating like it's at zero percent right now. Say the transmitter. This is the transmitter sending a signal back to the PLC saying you have zero percent, and then say. 25%, 25 25 percent 8 milliamps 8 milliamps so at 25 percent you should see a 25 percent uh, on your hmi or the plc should say oh the tank is at 25 percent and 15 to 50 and then 75 and 100 which is 20 milliamps a 4 to 20 milliamp signal and if it's set up that way that's what you should read 100 percent. so if you go to 100 percent on your hmi it should read 100 percent because you're at 100 percent. so the tank should show full right but this is only for testing purposes um so there you have it and then just bring it back down you know you want to check it at the high level midpoint and also the low point and if everything goes good then you know you have a bad transmitter it's not reading properly you might need to calibrate it or just replace it and um and everything from the you know, from the wiring back to the PLC is good. So there you go.